All right, hey everybody, welcome. This is episode three of Pokemon Crystal Legacy. My name is Joey. Sometimes I play games, but not very often. Episode two completed. We have two gym badges in just our first attempt of each of those gym badges. The screen looks a little different. Yep, uh, I decided to kind of clean up the current party where how they're presented and a little tongue-in-cheek reference to the new backyard football videos why are you betting it is a fictitious betting company i think i have to put that disclaimer out there because people are going to think it's a real thing and i thought each video we could do a little fun little prop thing and so uh today it's going to be the number of attempts is it going to take to beat whitney the over under half an attempt we did beat other gym leaders the two other ones faulkner and bugsy on our first try but I am thinking it's going to take more than one because as of right now, we have four Pokemon and three of them are going to be weak to Whitney's Milk Tank's signature rollout. And speaking of which, so off um, before I started recording, I just went out and leveled up uh, each of our party, I think except for Rocky, because everyone was pretty close to leveling up anyway. May as well level them up before... We get to the rival battle. Now, while I was leveling everybody up, I did find out Machop is over here. And I would like to get a Machop because I've never ran with a Machamp. And now we have the opportunity to do so because you do not need to trade to evolve those certain lines in this game. So uh, let's just do three wild encounters real quick. And if we don't see one, I'll just um, pause it and get to it. In fact, that might, be, that might just be the better thing to do. Like, what, what, what am I thinking? Oh my gosh, that took forever. No, I'm kidding. Actually, it was only like uh, three more attempts, but I just didn't feel like uh, putting everybody through that. So, let's see if we can catch this guy. And if nothing else, the fighting type would be resistant to that rock move of rollout. But knowing... Oh, jeez. Okay, that's getting pretty close there. Better start throwing balls at it. But knowing what... Smith was doing the wit the the Whitney pff. the Mill Tank probably had some sort of like I don't know, confusion or something like that. And the other thing I'm thinking about too, come to think of it, do I want a girl Machop because that we need a girl Pokemon. That Mill Tank probably has a tract, and you can say, you know. It, it, it works on opposite gender Pokemon. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. Come on. Stay in there. Stay in there. Stay in there. Oh, come on. What happened? Whatever happened to if I was a Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch because I'm sleeping. Try it again. So, yeah. Backyard Football, the new video is up. The highlights to Episode 2 is up. But I'm hoping that... There we go. La, 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 la. I'm hoping that everyone is enjoying uh, the two experiences. The superpower Pokemon. It trains by lifting rocks in the mountains. It can even pick up a graveler with ease. My goodness. My goodness. He's strong for a little guy. Give a nickname to a chop. So something I was also going to say that we're going to do in this video today um, as I hit ignore in there was we are going to actually nickname our Pokemon because... Um, you know, I think it could uh, help us all get a little more connected to the monster. There we go. I just said that time didn't have energy, but I also, I'm not going to think too hard on it. You know, we could think of little uh, cute little puns or whatever. So we got us a Machop. Let's see how long we're going to run with them because I I know my one buddy watched one of these videos and he said, Yo, Joe, yo Joey, you should really uh, substitute this guy for this guy and blah, 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 blah. And that's, gonna, that's bound to happen on things like this because I mean the thing that's really kind of killing us eventually we're gonna need water water covers so many typings we're gonna need water and we're going to need high psychic or something uh, so we're gonna give the berry to hop it because we may need him for Croconaw? Yeah, that's the second form of uh, Totodile. And is there anything I can give to Hoot Hoot? Mm. 
Bitter berry for confusion. Actually, wait, 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 wait. Because doesn't he have a... I'll give it to Rocky because... The rival leads with a Zubat. And Zubats usually have... Confuse, right? Supersonic? They might have both. And our new Machop is going to have the... Hang on a second here. I'm just readjusting the size of the viewer for the game. That way, okay, cool, cool, cool. Now we got something cooking. Uh, that way I can see the side uh, images at the same time. In fact, okay, that's better. I was just trying to clear some extra junk uh, out of the way of my screen. So let's go and heal up. And then take a crack at Rival 2. Come on now. Take a crack at Rival 2. I would have thought Hop Hip would have evolved by now. Hoot hoot. And I'm just going to save right here just in case. Uh, you know, we're, we're, we'll, we'll do a full battle, but. You know, just in case there's another reason. All right, so we'll put Hoot Hoot out front. Make sure Machop has the XP share because that's really all I can do right now. At level eight. And we're one Pokemon shy of a full party. Hmm. How many of these will stick around? We'll just find out. Meow, 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 meow. Oh. Meow, 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 meow. Tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? Did you watch my last video? What? You beat them? Ha! Huh. Quit lying. Why would I lie about something like that? You're not joking? Then let's see who's how good you are. This rival was probably I like I like this rival better than blue. But so not too bad. <laughs> I keep forgetting he's in butt. Oh, wait, I definitely want to lead off with Rocky. Hold on, I am going to reset. I just lied to all of you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> We're going to reset because I wanted uh, Rocky up front. I, I knew there was something I was forgetting there. All right, well, that's cool. Now you get to hear me do the dialogue again. All right, now we're good. Ooh, you're not supposed to reset. Oh, he came from the other direction. Tell me something. Oh, that's cool. We can see his face now. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? Did you not watch my last video? What? You beat them? Yeah, the one R is illuminated, friend. Quit lying. You're not joking? Now let's see how good you are. Don't. Okay, now, now we're in business. But wants to fight. That's that's why I tell my toilet every time after Taco Bell. All right, that's why we want Rocky at the front. Rock throw. Ah, see, yeah, I was ready for you. I was ready for you. So now, oops. Okay. I'm just trying to think. So Ghastly is likely the third Pokemon if it's sticking with Vanilla. And I'm just trying to think here. Is it worth switching out Rocky? I could hit it with a Screech and try to bring that defense down. Oh, come on. It, withhold it. You can, you can survive one. Come on. Damn. Damn. I mean, I know I know, double resistant and everything. So, geez, I would have been better off just switching out. Hmm. Okay. Hop it. This is, this is where we really need you. Let's... Hit him with the powder snow. Okay. Alrighty. So... 
with rage. What is it? Every time that we hit him, his his uh, attack goes up. Let me tail whip you a little bit. I forgot about rage. I remember it was just it was terrible in Gen One. You were stuck once you used it. Couldn't switch out to another move. Oh, that's right, we got the berry. All right, cool, cool, that'll help out a little bit. So now what I'm basically just doing is bringing the defense down in hopes that when we send out either Hoot Hoot or Quilava, we can, you don't have to um, give it as many hits. Oh, you could, oh my gosh, you could have critical hit. Okay, um, so, uh, do I want to send out Hoot Hoot or Quilava? I know Quilava can tank at least one of those water guns, and at least with Hoot Hoot, we do have foresight if we feel the need to use Tackle. Mmm, I could smoke screen you to death too. I, I, I hate being cheap like that. Oh, yeah, and we taught uh, Quilava Defense Curl. It learned Defense Curl um, when I was trying to level it up. Okay. That, that, that did some damage. Uh, defense Curl's not going to do any good. Let's just hit it with a tackle. Three, three stages of defense down, and okay, that was better than I expected. All right, can you can you can you please just it, it's in the red. There's not a lot. Tackle it and you don't die. There you go. You want to live. You want to you want to eat dinner tonight. All right, I'm definitely going to get you some kibbles and bits. You're a dog, right? He's actually supposed to be a volcano in the form of a a dog weasel thing. Oh, Machop grew to level 10. Yeah, I was getting worried we we're going to have to sacrifice Machop. Oh, he's got Larvitar! Ah, oh, duh, oh, jeez. Ah, uh, okay, that, that, ah. Uh. I could have watched Smith's video a little bit better or read the guide, but again, I don't want to spoil anything. Okay. Rock Pokemon... Um, smoke screen. Just, I'm gonna have to go with smoke screen and hypnosis on Hoot Hoot, and just hope that. Okay, so he's got rock throw. Uh, well, rock throw. At least the accuracy is gonna go down a little bit. Maybe I should just try it again. Bring that accuracy down to like a 40 piece. Should I defense curl? Uh, okay. Uh, this is gonna be a lot of not very effectives. It might, it might come down to a level 10 Machop. Oh, come on, Hoot Hoot, this is the best time to use Hypnosis, it's dark. Ah, oh, no, just more, more stuff. He's deruding me. Alright, come on, put this, put this, oh, oh, well, that, that's cute. Thank you, Smith, that's, that's very helpful. So my my real hope is that because uh, Hoot Hoot's not gonna knock out um, this guy. I think what tackle has more. Oh my gosh! Yeah, Hoot Hoot is not gonna knock out this Larvitar. So my only real hope is that uh, I can keep it asleep. And when it gets knocked out like it is right now... Uh, oh, gosh. Okay. All right, Machop. Level 10 Machop, you just came to the team. Oh, we, oh, we need you, buddy. Oh, we need you. Um, Just go for low kick and see what happens. Oh! Oh! Oh, we might have a shot. 
the, the, the sandstorm stopped. You want another sandstorm? We're gonna give you a, another low kick to the, the the horn. Oh! Let's go! Yeah! Just added to the team. I knew. I knew there was a reason for you to be added on. That knockout was brought to you by Beverage, another fictitious brand sponsoring this channel. One day, one day they're gonna, it's gonna be real. Mmm, that's good beverage. Yeah! Machop earning these points today! Oh man, that was clutch. Bah, that butt was defeated. Humph, <laughs> useless Pokemon. Listen, you. You only won because my Pokemon were weak. Ah. Uh, I hate the weak. <laughs> and the elderly. <laughs> and... And, um... <laughs> Who else does he hate? Um... Uh, solicitors. <laughs> Pokemon trainers, it doesn't matter who or what. I'm gonna be strong and wipe out the weak. Now that goes for Team Rocket too. They act big and tough in a group, but get them alone and they're they're weak. I hate them all. You stay out of my way. A weakling like you is only a distraction. I'm actually surprised that he doesn't push you there. And again, it's funny that uh he calls you a weakling despite losing. Come on now. Alright, so we're healed up and everything. Make sure this uh, volume is not blaring, because I know the last video I listened to it a little too late, and oh my gosh, the game audio was just blaring. And it was kind of drowning me out a bit, and I also did not have, I don't think I had this current microphone uh, when I did finally make the second video I think I was using that headset lavalier and so now we get to do the thing and we got repels right because this is definitely a uh, time to use it we have one repel uh, let, me, let me just go run and get a repel all right cool so I stocked up on items including some balls some super repels. They had super repels in there. Which we might have to... Oh, Paris. Um, I'm gonna try catching this guy just for the sake of using cut. So let's uh, speed it up a little bit. Okay, okay. Maybe, maybe use a different Pokemon here. Uh... Very nice. Very nice. Well done. Alright, well, they're added. It's added under our team, but it's really, really just going to be here for cut. Parasa's data was added to the Pokedex. The Mushroom Pokemon. The to Oh my gosh. Okay, this is, I'm, I'm going to screw this up. Tochukasu? Tokakasu. Tochu Kaso, Tochu Kaso, Tochu Kaso. Somebody, if, if I got that right, I want, um, I would like a cupcake, please. Growing on this thing's back, uh, orders it to extract juice from tree trunks. Well, that's, I guess, helpful for the earth. I don't know. Well, now after that, <laughs> Rocky's gonna need a, some juice. So, um, let's see how much, uh, of the HM we're gonna have to use. Aw, oh, man, my boss is gonna be steaming. The farfetch that cuts trees for charcoal took off of me. I can't go looking for it in the Ilex forest. It's too big, dark, it's scary for me. Punk, all right, let's, uh, super repel and save the day. I forgot there's like a mini puzzle to this, so 
Hopefully this doesn't take too long. It's the missing Pokemon! <laughs> Excuse me. Whoa! Okay, and I think we have to like chase it around this way so it comes down where those other d uh, dancing flowers are. Whoa! Okay, and if I talk to you... Or can I just like talk to you and force you to go this way? And then can't I just make you go down? Right? This is easy. Oh, okay. This was simpler than I, I seem to remember it being. Dummy. <laughs> okay, that was that was easier than I thought. And I, I like how quickly the boss came to like rip this kid a new one. Ah, uh, my far fetched. You found it for us, kid. You found it for us, kid. You found it. For, you found it for us, kid. Without it, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for charcoal. I guess tools and stuff don't exist in Pokemon Universe? Thanks, kid. Now, how can I thank you? You could take me out to Outback. Oh, I shouldn't have said their name. You could take me to a, a good quality chain steakhouse. I know, here, take this. Receive the one cut. Joey put HM1 cut. That's the cut HM. It's gonna use up a whole move slot on your Pokemon, and you're gonna have to go to Blackthorn City to release, to remove it. Uh, of course, you have the gym badge from Azalea to use it. Yes, I do. <laughs> wow, thanks a whole bunch! My boss's Pokemon won't obey me because I don't have a badge! As I'm telling you, like, tools, uh, there's not like a Pokemon Home Depot or Lowe's. Gotta go to Lowe's, gotta go to Lowe's, yeah. Oh, it's, that's for Models. I don't think that, that doesn't exist anymore. Alright, cool. Now, back in the day when I first played Pokemon, I... I forgot what, which Pokemon I had. I think I had Charmander. And I taught it Cut because it could learn Cut. And I, I did not know the ramifications of being stuck with that butt cheeks move forever. Now, one thing Smith did... Oh. Aw. Yo, I, <laughs> I know its HP is in the red, but damn, that John looked dead. Um, I can't see the type move it is, right? Uh, it's supposed to be a bug type move now, which actually makes a lot of sense. Now... I'm going to... Now we gotta, like, hit... Um, well, now that that puzzle's over, I'm okay with battling some... Oh, Silver Powder! This powers up bug moves. This makes sense for it to be here. Uh, we can run a little bit. There's that guy. I believe he's still going to teach you Headbutt. You know, the one only other dude in the forest. This nice old Valor went up. Yeah, the, the, I was talking about nicknaming things. It still bothers me that Rocky has a nickname and everyone else doesn't. I'm I'm really surprised. I did not think we were going to run with Rocky past the first gym. So I keep forgetting I could run. Oddish. Uh, actually, we should probably put up... Uh, this would be a good time for Hoot Hoot to be in front. Oops. All right, let's get headbutt from this guy because that could be a decent move. And I guess if we really want to, we could search for. See, it, it's funny. There are so many Pokemon I want to run with that I probably couldn't have in the original Crystal due to availability or items or whatever. I'm even thinking about Heracross. I don't think I've ever ran with Heracross on a team. What am I doing? Besides being in a dark forest alone with your lime green hair. I'm shaking trees using headbutt. It's fun. <laughs> yeah. Boy, <laughs> those hair. You try it too. Received headbutt. Rattle trees with headbutt. Sometimes sleeping Pokemon fall out. And if, if I were a sleeping Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. That dude said that. Alright, let's get out of the forest. While knocking out some hoot hootish, 
Oddish on the way. Um, Hoot Hoot should be evolving soon. Well, chat, you could, um, like, vote if you want me to nickname the Pokemon. Oh, wait. We don't have one. That joke stopped being funny the, the second time. Wrong, it wasn't funny the first time, either. Oh, there's another dude here. Don't sneak up on me like that! You frightened a Pokemon away! I'm sure that wasn't your inability to sing. La! If you guys want me to sing, I'm happy to do it, but we, we should probably start singing some Public Domain. In fact, and then we talked about Public Domain in the last episode, we gotta definitely watch some um, Brideless Groom uh, before this episode ends. That's Public Domain. I can't get in trouble for that, right? Oh, hey, Karate Chop! Which is fighting in Gen 2. I think Smith addresses that. He's going to address that for Yellow Legacy, that Karate Chop is actually a fighting move and not normal. It's funny, with the last video, when I was recording it, I thought, this is not going to make for a funny video at all. Um, I, I wasn't really feeling well. I uh, was tired from work. And uh, when I sat down to edit it, I'm surprised how much we were able to get out of it. It still wasn't funny, though. I hadn't seen that Pokemon before. Which one was it? A Pokemon I'd never seen before fell out of the tree when I used Headbutt. I ought to use Headbutt in other places, too. Maybe you should get your head out of your butt, so use Headbutt to debutt your head. I'm, I mean, de-head your butt. Alright, let's... Do I, I have antidotes? Uh, I don't think I do. Uh, oh, yeah, good, good. Alright, I have one, so we don't have to deal with that um, noise every couple seconds. That, and also, you know, my Pokemon dying. Are there any more trainers in here? Alright, well, that was nice that there was a second trainer. At least the other guy isn't alone. Did you see the shrine honoring the protector? I, it watches over the forest and across time. I think it must be a grass type Pokemon, you think so? Hi, lady. Oh, honey, you making a Pokedex? It must be hard if Pokemon don't appear. Try using one of the most useless TMs of all time. Sweet scent. I mean, I shouldn't say that because I guess it has its benefits. I mean, I just... You just don't know how to play Pokemon right. Just say you don't know Pokemon. Never. It's sweet scent, darling. Use it when, eh, where, whenever, wherever, wherever Pokemon appear together. Pokemon will be enticed by it. That's cool. Are you enticed by it? Uh, a flying thing? Freh! There's no one over here. There's a cash register. Excuse me, I took the purchase, please. Can you get back to work? Get behind the counter? That's right, it's still night. Um. Hey, I'm looking for Mankey. Okay, I'm looking for. Um, what's a celebrity I like? Do I, do I even like celebrities? Um, not really. My girlfriend saw the cat version of herself in, uh, <laughs> in the uh, highlights of the last video and just said, um, it, it's, it's odd, but it's cute. And I said, just like me. And she reluctantly agreed. I guess we can move Hoot Hoot out of the leadoff spot now that we're out of the forest. I know this is Picaspri's favorite, Teddy Ursa. I, uh, I guess you could say ripped a joke from him in the last video. I made sure uh put his channel in the description and address the fact that he came up with that first. That was playing Fool's Gold, where all the Pokemon there have a special Johto version, and so Ariados was like a ghost spider, and then Poliwag, that line was like made out of mud, so that's where the I have a spider and a ball of mud came from. Now, just 
Okay, we're gonna have to uh, defense curl. I just realized our only real special attackers are Quilava and Hoppip, and even then, what? Absorb isn't gonna do a ton, but we, we gotta do something. So we still need a special attacker. Is what's going on here. That, um, that under, I don't know how confident I am in that. Because the, the, the trek from Azalea to Goldenrod is not very long at all. It's, it's pretty darn quick. Oh, and I just realized we're going to get, we can put, we can basically put Paris away because we don't need cut again for, I mean, there's that one path on the way to Ecritique, but it's not going to do us any good anyway because we're going to have to get the water bottle for that set of widow. How early does Machop evolve? We'll just get Rocky in there. Oh, come on. Oh. I think Machop, we're going to run with him. I kind of owe it to him now after saving our behinds of that Larvitar. I was not expecting Larvitar. Beaten by a passing stranger. That's why I don't talk to strangers. I'm going to train even harder. I, I, feel, like, I feel like three other ones of you have said that. After all, I'm trying to become a gym leader. Yeah, I always kind of wonder that, is is how does one become a gym leader? In fact, I'm going to mute this for a second, because I always kind of thought, well, there has to be some sort of process, there has to be an application process, there has to be an interview process, do you just go on Pokemon like, Indeed or LinkedIn? And then on top of that, how do certain things, like, th there's got to be some type of assessment of you, like, you can't be, if, well, let's say, okay, let's say that the Elite Four are, like, your, um, supervisors or managers or whatever you want to call them they have to have some sort of assessment of you a quarterly assessment something like that where they kind of evaluate how you are as a gym leader oh do we want to go with abra mm, abra's gonna outspeed us here right yeah of course um, we see another one I'll throw a pokeball at it because I mean we can kind of get rid of Paris at this point and we do need a special attacker um, so the, the Elite Four, or whomever your, bleh, your bosses are, let's turn it down a little bit, there we go, they'd have to look at you every quarter, so let's say Faulkner, for instance, Faulkner should not be a gym leader, Faulkner, first of all, should just not be a gym leader, um, using his dad's Pokemon, I think, alone, is grounds for, you know, reassignment. And we, I get it, in the early gens, you know, everything was about game progression and, you know, you weren't going to have legally like a level 75 Pokemon by the first town or level 100. There was that weird like Nidoking glitch or whatever. Okay. Because I, I thought about this a lot. I've done a lot of thinking about this. So let's say everyone comes in and trashes Faulkner just completely destroys Faulkner, right? At some point now, everybody's getting a badge left and right. They, they, they try to make it sound like acquiring a badge is such a difficult thing to do. That kid in Ilex Forest could get the badge as long as he just gets like a bird Pokemon. He should be able to get the badge, train it up. He already got the Farfetch'd, right? Get another one. The daycare's not far away. Breed the thing. And you could go knock out Bugsy. Now, of course, there's this whole thing about the, the correct order of gyms, and let, let's let's take the constraints of the actual game out of out of play here. So Faulkner is getting trashed, and you would think the Elite Four or whomever would have to look at him and say, "Okay, you're you're not doing something right here because everyone is just steamrolling you." Now, at the same time, he can't come out with level 100 Articunos and, 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 you know, 
legendaries and things like that, and then he steamrolls everybody. There's got to be some sort of happy medium, and there's got to be a point where if you're just butt juice, you just can't be a gym leader anymore, or you're suspended or something. And the other thing, uh, the volume, how's that there? How's that sounding? It's a little low. I don't want it too low. I want everyone to be able to still hear the music, the ambiance. Looking at my levels here. As long as we can hear me, that's the real reason you're turning in, right? Don't answer that out loud. So yeah, I mean, we could do another video where I could talk about that all day, where it's like, what does it take to become a gym leader? How are you? Certainly you'd have to be... I would think that you have to beat the Elite Four, but I think according to, like, mangas and other things like that, that's not necessarily the case that gym leaders have or have not beaten the Elite Four. I think in some cases, what, like, Janine was is Koga's daughter, and that, that weird kid from Sword and Shield with the white hair, who I thought was a girl the whole time until I read the pronoun, uh, well, let me be careful there, until somehow it was revealed that it was a boy, um, that old lady from that fairy gym just saw him and liked his outfit and became a gym leader. It seems kind of, um, like, what, like, how are you qualified? Are you a trainer? Let's have a practice battle. <laughs> Sweetheart, this is going to be a real battle. You're not going to give me practice money after this. Picnicker Gina is ready to battle. She's ready to practice battle. Up, oh, Hopip, look, it's your. Uh... Oh, I, <laughs> I didn't realize Hopip was in front, even though I just put him there. Uh, now let's switch you out to Hoot Hoot. I would have ran Gus, but somebody forgot that Gus was a thing and deleted it. Another awkward middle stage Pokemon. Skip Loom. Like, Hopip's adorable. Jump Bluff has that, like, cool, like, color change to the, the blue. And then Hop Skip Loom just kind of like, hey. All right, Machop. I'm chopping it up. Oh, hey, Bulbasaur. Hey, it's good to see you. It's really good to see you. I oh, like Bulbasaur. Oh, how did you leech me? I have wings. Not gonna matter now. There we go, everyone's growing up before our eyes. Oh no, I just can't win. Don't worry, it was practice, but those are some real polka dollars. Hey, uh, Smith, I don't know if you have been watching any of these, and like, I'm, I'm not trying to refer to you as if like, you know, I'm your best friend or something. Uh, but there was one video where you actually referred to the polka dollars as yen. Uh, I don't know if you got uh, reamed for that or not, but uh, I had to like look it up. I was like, wait a second, am I wrong here? I, I thought these were like just polka dollars. I just got my Pokemon back from the daycare. They was getting it on. Let's be real. Let's be real. Take a sip of beverage right here. <coughs> okay, that's my own fault. That is a um a bold ginger ale. And it really uh really uh hits the, the windpipe a little different. Hey, that kid wasn't with you. That kid wasn't with you. Let's go, Brandon. Alright, I, I I shouldn't say right, I look I'm a very neutral person when it comes to politics. I'm right in the center. I, I'm not gonna I just, it's the first thing I thought of. Um, if anyone is coming over here from, like, Smith or Pacaspi or J-Rose uh, or some others, I just know those three, if I'm, please correct me if I'm wrong, all three of them are from Canada. And I love hearing when O-U is pronounced by them. So, oot. I'm, I'm saying that endearingly. But... I can sing O Canada. I have it memorized. I I'm a I'm a proud American. I am. I'm proud to be from America. Um 
but it's such a it's a good anthem. Well, what's your problem with the Star Spangled Anthem? Why are you going to sing some Canadian stuff? That's a great question. I mean, I just know it from sporting events whenever an American team and a Canadian team, you know, uh, Toronto Blue Jays, the Raptors, um, half of the NHL, (laughs) when they play, they play both anthems. So would you like me, would you like me, viewers, to sing Oh Canada for you. Just check in. I'm, 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 why am I saying like I'm gonna get an answer? This isn't even live streamed. First of all, this isn't. This isn't even a <coughs> live stream. Sorry. I know the last video we discussed this already. <sighs> Someday I'll sing it for you. So as always, our goal has been in each video to get to the next gym leader and at least attempt one battle. Will we get there tonight? I always say this, I don't know. I look at the running time, but the videos so far have not really exceeded an hour and a half. And I've seen some streamers who go way further than that. Why does it always end this way? That's... That's why I ask myself every night before I go to bed. It all started when I was born. My Pokemon knew moves I didn't know it had. That confounded me to no end. Well, did you, did you check then? Did you hit the start menu? All right, we got a couple more trainers on here. And I'm just, I'm just trying to think who should be in front at this point. I guess we could put Machop up and go for the double bubble with the XP share. Um, or we could give it to Hopip, I guess. Because um, it, it's just, I'm... And yet again, I'm thinking too much about these teams that we're going to face. Because they, they are different. I, I don't know if there's any team that's necessarily... Wait... Did I give you XP share? Duh. Yeah, you did. Um, there's not really a team that's completely untouched from vanilla. I'm the best in my class at Pokemon. Yeah, because I guess they don't have like actual real classes like agriculture or ethics or... Uh, homeroom oh Mankey you gotta talk to that other kid he wanted one the, the kid down the street alright duel it out you f- f- crazy fighting mons oh okay I don't know if the V's or whatever are good on this but my chop is chopping him up Oh, that little turd. Come on, this should be a one-hitter. Diglets are made out of glass. Right, I thought so. No! There are better trainers! Yeah, how many badges you got? Zero? I'm trying hard so I can be the star of my class. You just said you are the best in class. But you hope you better hope I don't show up one day and be like, hey, you know this kid's butt juice, right? Um, then there's there's like a security guard over here. But you actually have to talk to him. What an interesting little chime he has. Who goes there? What are you up to? Walking down the street, living my best life, not stealing from anyone, not hurting anybody. Officer Keith wants to value. Your name would be Keith. I don't know what their goal was with um, the cops and battling them at night thing. Oh, yikes. Let's, let's get you out of there. 
Oh, wow. And Machop really is putting, but he's going to get knocked out. Um, I don't know what the whole thing was. Maybe they were still trying to just kind of show off the day-night cycle thing. Because it's not even like a really epic battle. It's a level 16 Growlithe, and that's it. You'll get an item. You shouldn't get arrested. <laughs> All right, level 16. I forget when Machop evolves. And hop it. I hop it should. One of these two should evolve. You're a tough little kid. I don't. I don't. Okay. Up. Oh, nope. Neither one of them are evolving. Okay. Cool. All right. Let's uh, talk to these elderly people and get us an egg. So I'm not even gonna say hello. I'm just gonna go straight to your PC. And we're gonna deposit. Paris. I always love how they do that little cry before you like you store them as if like it's like no don't it's awful in here I mean it probably is uh, that's why the 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 theory of what is it like the um the theory of inside the pokeball is like replicating the Pokemon's habitat and kind of makes you feel a little bit better all right do we talk to old man or old lady first I'm the daycare man. Do you know about eggs? I had a lot of discussions about them already. I was raising Pokemon with my wife, you see. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible is that? Well, wouldn't you like this egg? Then fine, it's yours to keep. I think it'd be an option. I received an odd egg. I, was, I found that when I was caring for someone's Pokemon before, but the trainer didn't want the egg, so I kept it around. Maybe you even ask me. I'm the daycare lady. Do you know about eggs? My husband and I were raising some Pokemon, you see. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible could that be? Should I raise a Pokemon for you? Oh, then we're going to get a second egg for a second. Come again. Thank you. Now, the egg hatched, the first egg, the Togepi egg, hatched ridiculously fast. So, let's see how long this one is going to take us, and we'll see if it's anything good. If, it, if it's anything that involves a stone, it's probably going to be thrown away. It's going to be a stone's throw away into the, the water over there. There you are, type. You're going to drown. I'm confident in my ability to raise Pokemon. Want to see? I to switch up these voices. I feel like every male voice is defaulting to Nyah! Oh! You got the Azumarill. That early at 15? Yikes. Alright, well... Oh, jeez, I forgot my child's gonna die. Uh, let's get you out of there. Um, you know what? I'd rather at least get a shot at you. Oh, you're gonna defense curl me? Okay, so the neutral means, yeah, fairy's definitely not a thing. Um, well, let's just keep going until he knocks this wood, which is right now. Gen 1 Azu, not Gen 1, Gen 2 Azumaril. Hill, 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 my name's Azumaril. <laughs> Give me a hug. Um, may as well just go hop it, right? Let's put some poison snow on you. Oh, no, 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 no. This is just a preview about what we're about to deal with. Uh, well. I guess I'll just let you knock me out, right? Um, well, he's going to be stuck in it. I did get that first. Uh, I'm just trying to think what's the best way to go here. Just let him roll himself out. Uh, we could bring his defense down a little bit, I guess. Oh! Oh, well, they missed. Alright, well then, there goes that. Okay. I'm almost so worried about. Yikes. Well, he didn't do much. Oh, okay. You're becoming a little butt juice now there, Azumaro. <laughs> Not now! 
<laughs> uh, you heard me talking that, talking that poop talk. Um, I mean, we're right near Goldenrod. Honestly, a part of me wants to just kind of like roll the dice with Hoot Hoot here. I can put it to sleep and just let it poison itself to death. Oh, that's right. I can't put it to sleep if it's, <laughs> if it's already poisoned. Oopsies. Uh, let's see what happens. Oh, gosh. Yeah, you're gonna die, Hoot Hoot. Sorry. I had the best intentions in mind. And just got pancaked. Ooh, Al Pancakes. Mm. Alright, Rocky. It's up to you, because only you can resist this. There you go. Did I screw up my training? No, but your mom did. Oh! How old is this guy again? 32? Yeah. And you're recording this from your parents' basement, you said? Yeah. You gotta look at your life priorities, man. Hey, shut up! I'm doing the best I can. I'm just trying to make people happy. Brighten up their day a little bit with the, some some Pokemon playthroughs, and you, you just gotta be a little butt rag. Let's save because we're here in a new city. Just seems like it's always what you're supposed to do. Hi, baby. A higher level Pokemon doesn't always win. After all, it may have tight disadvantage. I don't think there is a single Pokemon that is the toughest. Comments will flood saying as to who. I'll tell you who the toughest is. You ready for this? The radio town going around cities Lema. They're running a promotional campaign right now. They'll modify your poker year so we can all deserve as a radio. Oh yeah, let's go do that. I don't know how much we need the radio, but I guess it's fun to have. And then no one's just addressing this guy. So this is the radio tower. What do you want, you pest? Scram! I'm in public. Welcome! Welcome. Welcome. We could just not put her in the game at all. <laughs> could have put that uh, data towards like a, a true Cinnabar Island or something. We have a special quiz. Can I know it's a girl. It's like a NPC lady, but we have a special quiz campaign on right now. Answer five quests. Tian's correctly to win a radio card. Slide it into your Poke Gear to play the radio anytime, anywhere. Would you like to take the quiz? Let's see if uh, Smith uh, adjusted these. Question one. Is there a Pokemon that appears only in the morning? Yeah. Cool. All right. Your second question. Is this statement correct? You can't buy a berry at a mart. In this universe. No, you can't. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Was that a double negative I just missed there? All right. And they just let you just take it as many times. You may as well just give me the radio. Like, you may as well just give me the radio card, honestly. If you're just gonna let me take this a million times, is this statement correct? You can't buy a berry at a mart. I guess Smith made some adjustment to it, so it's not true. Okay. Bullseye. Question three. Does HM1 contain the move Flash? Nope. Uh, so far, so good. Question four. Is Faulkner the Violet Gym Leader who uses Bird Pokemon? His dad's. Bird Pokemon, yes. Wow, right again. Here's the final question. Do Golden Rod game corner slots have Charmander on their reels? Oh my gosh, you're really going to make me just go all through that again? Alright, we got to fast forward this, come on. Like, I wasn't going to go into the in the gym corner, the game corner. Now my, my thing can tune in as a, as a radio. Yay. Hey, what? Radio, Monday night, Radio Tower 1F, Fish Shore. Okay. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Banana. 
Pokemon Music Channel. It's me, DJ Ben. Today's Monday, so chill out to Pokemon Lullaby. Lullaby, Pokemon Lullaby. Go to sleep with Pokemon. Not bad. Only will cut a dental out of it. Uh, so we would have to get the coin. I forgot Golron has a lot going on in it. So yeah, it, it um, we may not. I keep doubting myself. I don't want to talk to you. This is like what Bill's house. If Bill was here, I keep doubting myself as to whether or not we'll actually get around to battling these gym leaders. There's some shops downstairs, but there are also trainers. I'm scared to go down there. I'm, I'm scared to do anything. Everyone's everyone's scared in this game. Uh, so we're going to do some battles. Um, Machop, as much as I want to give him the double bubble, I mean, he's been able to just lay down work. <laughs> I got booted out of the game core. Nerr, I was trying to cheat using my Pokemon. That would be helpful in a casino nowadays, but... They they have cameras in the cards, let's, let's be real. And forget slots. Uh, ah, everything's fighting. That's right. Every move is fighting! There's still a lot of coverage opportunities for us here, and, um... It'll be interesting as to whether or not we really... What we do, so I—I I mean, let's let's be real. We know that this team is going to get adjusted at some point. We need someone that's going to surf. Uh, we've got our flyer. Um, I do like having an electric Pokemon because electric does take care of you know the many flyers that we have in the game and the waters. A psychic Pokemon like an Abra and Alkazam would be nice. Oh. So we're doing that now, too. Withdrawing. That's all right. That's a nice little uh, tidbit there. Because there was only one class of trainers in Gen 1 that would withdraw. They were the jugglers. And what a what a cute little coincidence that they juggle their Pokemon. Ha ah, ha, you thought. You thought, you little orphan. Ha. Ah, where are your parents? That's another little... Going back to that whole thing with Kangaskhan and, like, the missing piece to, like, Cubone or whatever. You breed a Cubone, it's going to be born with its dead mother's skull. Okay. Speed it up already! No. We're not speeding up trainer battles, I told you. Oh, that's right. Hop, we've got the double bubble going. Uh, we gotta switch you out because that absorb is not gonna do anything. Here, let's get let's get hoot hooted on the phone. Oh, I should get like Qualava back in too. I don't want to completely ignore him. I just know. <coughs> I just know with the um, Whitney and the rollout, it's like ah oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I gotta heal you now, because I don't feel like dealing with the poison noise. Oh, my gosh. Okay, this is gonna take a while. Just put Quilava in. I was thinking. Sorry. Sorry, everybody. Sorry. I can't wait till we actually like do. Oh my gosh, that's not even a. That wasn't even a physical move. So we're able to like do this live and interact more so I can get like votes in on like over, under, and things like that. That'll be fun. You shouldn't, you shouldn't encourage gambling. I don't care if it's not a real like um, a betting book, you shouldn't encourage it. I'm like telling people to put down money. Grumble. You hungry? Uh, I don't feel like going back to the Pokemon Center just yet, and I don't have Antidote on me. <laughs> I guess I have to do things fair and square. 
No, you don't. My Pokemon just got a haircut. <laughs> uh, odd contrast to the little music. I'll show you how strong it is from his haircut. Yes, we all get strong after haircuts. I need to get a haircut. Oh, licky licky. I mean, lick a tongue. Hold on. That's my impression of a lick a tongue cry. That's my sister. My sister's not a Pokemon fan, but lick a tongue was always its favorite because of how absurd. A lick a tongue learned lick, finally. It's just like lick a tongue is just so absurd. It is still absurd. Licky licky's absurd too, but I. Lick a tongue should have just stayed how it was. Have a good level 17. It's trying to learn sleep powder. Um. Would I rather have sleep or poison? Sleep. Mm -hmm. Aye! I'm just reading what it says. I found coin case. The missile already down here. Missiles battle everybody else. Uh, there's nobody open. Hey, can you, can you cut hair for me? Do you consider type alignments in battle? If you know your type advantages, you'll do better in battle. Just spoon feeding the player. Super new Teru. Isn't that the, the like online market bar Timu? That's Timu. About time. Man, Voltor was so cool. It was a, a Pokeball with eyes. What would like a baby Voltor be like if, if Voltor had a baby in its line? Oh, you think you're so great with your screech and your tackle? Yeah, they didn't do, they didn't do piddly squat. Piddly squat? Yes, this is diddly squat. Oh, Porygon. I'd like to run with Porygon. And Porygon 2, I can upgrade it. Who wants the artificial... Por oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Machop, come on. You can survive. All right, good. Wow, you survived that, uh, that, uh, duck, origami duck thing. No, oh, no, no, that's not right. Speed tie. That's encouraging, though. I thought Porygon was somewhat fast. Oh, nice little XP gain there. Wow. Oh, that didn't sound like Magnemite's normal cry, at least through my headphones. It usually has that little... How can a magnet tackle? When do you get Thief? That's like not until Blackthorn City, right? Because I'm just trying to think if... Remember, Wild Magna might have like a certain percent chance of... Um, ow! 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 Have having a Metal Coat. And if we can get it early, why not? Maybe Evolve Rocky. I think you have some rare Pokemon with you. Let me see them. You sound like my friend Drew. Just nosy all the time. Ask me things like my credit score. Like, you just don't ask a person that. All right, you poisoned, uh, just go after it. Trainers, like, ha like, they had to, like, look at you and, like, lick their lips and rub their hands together, like, oh, you already got poisoned. Ah, oh, that's right, I had a berry. Ah, oh, to crap. Uh, I keep, that, that's the thing I hate about these berries is I forget they're equipped and I could have just easily saved it for, like, Whitney or something. I mean, I can always just go and get them back um you can't get back to the other cities until you've gotten Soto Widow out of the way so that's a very long walk back just to get some berries I mean even if I pause 
the um, recording for you. Like, that's just, that's just doing too much. Wow, come on. I didn't do it. Didn't do anything. Uh, keep, just keep spamming it. There we go. Can you evolve now, please? Ah, the second one. Come on, come on. Just spamming A over here. There we go. All right, that takes care of the cellar dwellers. Gah! I lost, that makes me mad. What? Hop of his evolving, but that time. Hey, Green Bean. Congratulations, your hop hip evolved into Skiploom. You must be very proud. I am actually. My little skip bloom growing before my eyes. Oh, it's only done a little bit. Jeez. I'm not make ever deaf again. There we go. Well, I've I've thought it over, and I I, I do want to nickname these guys because it's just it's just gonna keep bugging me if we do run with Rocky the rest of the way. I was challenged to battle downstairs. It's rough down there. You better be careful. Yeah, well, when you're not butt juice, you know, it's not it's not scary. I thought just a smidgen. There we go, there we go, there we go. There we go, it also makes it easier on editing too. All right, so I'm gonna nickname these suckers and we'll be right back when I'm finished with that. Okay, I just unpaused it. I did finish nicknaming everybody, but, but Liz the Pitnicker called me Hi, Tania. How are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but I'm bored silly. Huh? Wrong number. Oops. Okay, alright, alright. That was kind of funny. I really thought for a second like a glitch happened or something. Alright, henceforth our guys are known as Porky. I'm like a chop, get it? Albert. <laughs> Quilliam. I know he's going to evolve into Typhlosion, but I, I thought about the other day and I really like the idea of Quilliam. Rock. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can't change their nicknames. Hoppled, like hop it. It's like the full version of it. I know it's going to be jump bluff eventually. And then egg. It's making sounds inside. It's going to hatch soon. Wonder what kind of sounds it's making. Yeah, I got worried for a second. I was like, what kind of glitch just happened that I'm now Tania or Tanya or whatever? So, and on my way, sir. Let's go heal up. So, do we need the bike? Is that gonna make us go super speed or cause we're already running and stuff? Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Shouldn't you not want to see me again? Okay. So I guess we should get some items just to have on hand, and let's also just see what's in the stores here. Cause I gotta remember I'm also kind of giving Um Smith some some <laughs> What am I saying? The guy has like 500, 600, 700,000 subscribers, and here I am about to say like, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm giving him some exposure for this game. Like, yes, I, if anything, I'm getting the exposure because he made this game. Thank you very much, sir. Ah, I really, I was really about to say something so pretentious there. Uh, I guess it couldn't hurt for us to have a couple revives on us. Uh, but what I was getting at was just seeing what the stores do and don't have um it's in that guide as well that he put up but welcome how can i help you i've never used it in fact let me actually sell some of these i always like how goldenrod sounded on super speed 
Yeah, I'll take a hundred dollars for that every corn. Um, okay. No running in the store. What do you got? Okay, you're the vitamin guy. Right, this is the TM shop, right? Are these just elemental punches? Yeah, electric punch, fire punch, ice punch, and headbutt. Hmm. Trying to think, like, who would benefit from punches right now? Uh, hang on, guys. I gotta. Yeah, my bad. I had to. A... Had to tend to stuff. That's what I love about OBS, just being able to pause it. And it's despite the slight jump in the music, really nothing, nothing missed here. Um, did she give you something? Do you listen to the Lucky Channel? If you want to win, trade Pokemon with as many people as possible. That's gonna be kind of tough in this day and age, sweetheart. If you're tired, try the vending machine's drinks. Your Pokemon will love them too. Couldn't really do anything with them. So, uh, I mean, we're getting to the point now. I, I, okay, so he, here's what I want to do at this point. And I think what I might do for the next video is, you, you know, rather than the why are you betting thing, I, I, mean, I kind of like that. See, like, I, I really do like, this is one of the things that I've loved since the original Backyard Football since the new the comeback that i put up and now doing these pokemon runs is like it's my playground in terms of what i want on the screen what kind of jokes i want to put on what kind of humor i want to use and what i was going to get to saying was that if we made like a to-do list or a goal list for the episode that could be something um i'm open to suggestions i mean this is um what's what's yours is mine and what mine's La, 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 la. Say it again. What's yours is mine's, and what mine's is ours. Who knows what movie that's from? Are you going to the gym? Uh, that, that's not the right voice, huh? Are you going to the gym? Me too. Only mom can have that Marge voice. Wait, did I heal? I healed, right? It was only a pause on OBS, but I actually like paused it for like a good solid twenty minutes. So now I gotta, you know, you could say, oh, you just healed. What are you talking about? All right. Yeah, I guess Porky could use that. We haven't hit a level cap yet, so I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. Oh, you're going to roar me? Yeah, look what you got. Rock Snake. I mean, we know we can't get past Soto Widow. So we're kind of contained here. I guess for me at this point, it's just kind of leveling up and getting as close as we can. And, you know, I'm trying to show my girlfriend I'm hot stuff. See, I, t I told my girlfriend about there's a couple trainers in the Pokemon uh, universe. There's this guy, Camper Elliot, and then a guy from Gen 1 who tells you that he's cool because he has a girlfriend. So actually, when I made that joke in the last full episode that was kind of a uh, wink to that i was like i have a girlfriend oh, okay you're gonna sand attack me who are you me uh so let's just let's just bring uh popled out now i gotta start calling these guys by their uh new names now ah, you thought you thought with your little faulkner behind that your dad's saying true? Another thing, if we want to go into like the what ifs of the Pokemon universe, I guess, yeah, Pokemon are registered to trainer ID, so is it like illegal to use another? I, I guess Falcon probably traded, but what, I wonder, what, what do you trade with your dad? Let's get, like, level two Rattata? Hey dad, thanks. Trust me, this is gonna be a good one. Oh, I just love Marvel's Cry. Get new material. It's tough, man. I don't have a chat. I, I think I'm doing the best I can. You are doing a good job, Joey. 
Thank you, mysterious person. I, <laughs> I don't mean to like pat myself on the back too much, but um, because in real life I do have so many non sequiturs and sidebars where I'll make sure that I change my voice distinctively mid-conversation so you know that I'm like trying to pretend to be another person. I wish you would have lost for me. Nah. Nah, son. I'm not a white knight like you. I am white, though, in real life. Um, what I was getting at was, I, I really got a kick out of... <laughs> I wonder if... I wonder if my girlfriend would ever say the following. What's my voice for her again? Hold on. <laughs> my boyfriend's weak, so I can't rely on him. You could faintly hear her voice in the other video, but she sometimes gets... She has, like, a little, like... Valley Girl accent, like a little like Jersey Valley Girl accent, so oh, I, I tease her a lot for it. Alright, Picnicker Brook. Chew. Uh, yeah, so what I was getting at was um, as you can see, I've, I've used this cat with my real human eyes and, and mouth for the logo and whatever the game series is we're playing, you know, that me will be wearing something. So for instance, we have Ethan's hat for this. For backyard football, we have like the football eye paint. When Yellow Legacy gets released, I'll probably actually make it like the Pikachu cheeks and the ears. Um, but what I've loved doing when I started doing the last episode was now I can just make the, the cat me into anything. So I just had two random people. The guy had like a top hat and a monocle, and it was just like a lady with like a bob wig and lipstick to indicate the idea of other people talking about me. So I'll do that from time to time. Oh my, you're so strong. Yeah. Oh. She started off with good evening. That doesn't sound like, that sounds bad. Good evening, Joey. This is Liz. Are you awake? Hey, yo. Hey, yo, you, when you be sending her them texts or them calls, ooh. Do you have some free time? I I have a girlfriend, man. I'm cool. I've got all sorts of time. All right, baby, baby. I, uh, if you're watching this, which I I don't know if you are, because my because she doesn't like watching the full like hour long things. I understand. That's like totally fine. Like that, that doesn't hurt my feelings at all. And I'm not like I'm not joking either to like cover up being hurt. I totally get not wanting to watch an hour and a half long Pokemon videos. Like that, that's a, that's a very niche thing. Get back to the video, Joey. Oh, yeah, sorry. If you're free, would you like to battle? I'll be waiting on Route 32. Mwah. Yeah, but, I mean, I try telling her I have a girlfriend. I can count on more my Pokemon than my boyfriend. Damn, I've heard that before, too. Hey, baby, if you're listening, name three Pokemon, and you can't name any of the, <laughs> any Pokemon that you've seen or heard on this uh, playthrough. I've been getting Pokemon data off my radio. I think I'm good. I think you're mid, and I'm about to prove it to you. Ivan. I knew this guy named Ivan in real life. We called him Onions. Ah. Uh, no, oh, I don't feel like doing it. Come on. There we go. I'm gonna knock it out. One hit. One hit. All right, Oko. We got a Oko. Cobbled. <laughs> All right, come on. Let's get this little turd. This little. Can you say the words? I I really okay. I do like to. You give. It is better to give than receive. I I mean, okay, obviously there's been innuendos through this. I do try to keep, like, my language clean for the most part. Um, this is a family channel. And I do want to curse for the comedic effect, but at the same time, you know, it, it, in comedy, if you can be funny without cursing, like, that is a big flex because you have to work harder. Behold my graceful ball dexterity. 
This guy is 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 ambidextrous with his balls. Look at them balls. Come on, juggler. So what would the red, blue, yellow equivalent of progress in the game be for where we are right now? Like SSN? We are two badges. You had to go through Mount Moon. Yeah, take care. You had to go to Bill's house. Yeah, I guess it would be SSN. Oh, I gotta put this space here back. I'm in the, my parents' basement. Yeah, I hope to be an inspiration to people out there who are, like, older and living at home. I mean, like, look, I... I said, me and my girlfriend are not married. I don't have kids. We don't have kids. Um, it's just no point of me. You know. All right, let's go to that mid-absorb. Oh, thank you. You know, my parents are older too, you know, it helps out and I mean, you know, if you're if you're 32 um and living with your parents, I hope I'm some inspiration to you. I still work a full-time job. I'm, I'm I I contribute positively to this society. I don't steal, I don't hurt people, and I don't sleep in the basement. I just record down here because um I have privacy. It is a little bit soundproof down here. Everyone leaves me alone. Um, cause it's funny because I was I was recording some uh, audio earlier. And I was making like a ah uh, noise that you've heard several times before already perhaps. And I, I did a few takes of it. My mom opens the door. Like, Joseph! Because she will say Joseph or Joe. One of those. Um, Were you calling me? And I, no, I'm sorry. I'm just recording. I actually have a little sign in the basement door that says recording if you need me, text me, because, you know, we live in this day and age. I don't know what he's trying to do with this video stuff. Like, he, he, he screams into the microphone and plays that Pac-Man game from when he was, like, 10. No, uh, no joke. When I got my Game Boy for my birthday, uh, Game Boy Color, um... There were several times after that my mom, and I'm not kidding, would refer to it as a Pac-Man. Like, did you bring your Pac-Man? Um, probably because of those two syllables and the same similar number of letters. And I, I don't know, I'll never be a mother, but I, I don't know if it's in, like, the Mother's Alliance or in, like, the Union, like, charter that you just have to screw up the names of things or add an unnecessary S to the end of things. Like, instead of saying the supermarket Aldi, you say Aldi's. I know several mothers that do it. By the way, I'm not sponsored by Aldi, but uh, you want to throw me a couple bucks, uh, DM me for the cash app. Ooh, that was a jolt. So I guess let's cl let's clear all the trainers that we got here. We might as well. Um, sorry, so this is the game plan. Because let's see, how far are we into this video? An hour and 23 minutes. Oh gosh, I think this, I think this is going to be fun. Um, I'm practicing my fire breathing. Wait, this might be fire breather dick. Wait, 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 wait. Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Fire breather wall... Like I said, again, I soon remember Crystal purposely editing Fire Breather Dick, but I mean, I, I never th thought that to necessarily be a dirty, like, name. I mean, yeah, you could have gone with, like, I don't know, Elder... D no, that would have been worse. I, I'm glad I didn't even finish that thought. I mean, it's still a person's name. I don't know how they got it from Richard. But, oh... That's the only context that we're going to talk about that on this channel. This is still a family channel, darn it. I didn't want to. Do, I wanted to rock through it. Come on. Yeah, let's get let's get everyone in this route knocked out. Let's go through the gym and at least take a shot at Whitney. Because um, I know some of you probably put bets in, and by putting bets in, I mean like in your head. Once again, if there's a, a gaming commission or something that's watching this, I'm sorry. If you think this is a real gambling thing, like I'm, I'm sorry. You're just, you're just, you're just stupid. I know you're just trying to do your job. Oh, Rocky and Dick, we could use that. Yeah, we could use that. Let's get, 
I'll keep tackle because it'll still be good to have a normal move. But let's get dig and we can put the hard stone back on Rocky. Um, but yeah, no, it's funny. I thought about that after I made the original backyard football video. Was like, clearly this is a satire thing. Jeez, this is clearly a satire thing. Like, no one is going to bet on a animated computer game um, in which it's not live. You know, I don't do live streams of backyard football. Wow. I mean, I don't even do live streams of this. I guess what I mean by like is a, li a live recording. There you go, put it that way, a live recording. Uh, that, I, no, that's what I meant. I do a live recording, but I edit it. I don't upload the organic backyard football. Ow! I scorched the tip of my nose! Just the tip? Hey, yo. So, um, yeah, I, I thought to myself, like, you know, there might be somebody out there, whether it's, um, like an algorithm check, an AI thing or whatever, that might see the thing like, why are you betting? That's why I made sure to, like, make up a, a, um, a betting app. It's not real. Look it up all you want. Um, but I get such a kick out of, um, I mean, I, I will say, like, I do, I do do sports betting. Haven't done any recently because I've been ice cold. You gotta take a break when you're ice cold. And I also just like, in everyday life, saying, like, what's, like, the over-under on, like, the number of, uh, like, chicken wings, like, our friend eats at this party or something like that. Um, I've noticed over time, so I've, I've mentioned a few times video on this channel that, like, I am someone with ADHD, and I didn't get diagnosed until, like, much later, like, my mid-20s or whatever, and I struggled mightily in grade school. One subject I really didn't do well in is math, but now, now that I've been, like, you know, being, like, treated properly and all that other stuff, I actually going to find I really do, like, math and accounting and things like that, and... You know, have I put it to work? Well, I mean, what do you think? I'm in my parents' basement playing Pokemon. But that's one of the reasons why I like sports betting. Ooh, a Psyduck. We do need a water Pokemon, but Psyduck? Let's just uh, knock the thing out. I mean, like, Golduck is just not an exciting water type. We're going to need to get a water Pokemon soon, but maybe we'll come back to it. I'll go anywhere if a bug Pokemon appear there. Alright, Arnie. Let's get Porky out of here. I probably should have I should have known that this is a bug catcher here. Uh, it's an hour and a half. Now, I mean, I looked at, like, for instance, Pacaspri. Uh, his videos will be... Yo, there's been a lot of critical hits lately. His videos will run nearly three-something hours, some of them. But, uh, as I mentioned in the uh, highlights of episode two, he's someone who's actually successful, actually has a following. And the chatters eat it up. Uh, maybe someday, but not today. But, I, I mean, I like... I like videos like this myself as background noise, as whatever, uh, given that you have a charming um, player, someone who's talkative and able to keep the combos going about anything and everything. Like, for instance, let's talk about, I'm talk about the weather. No, come on, one, one, one of my, this is a first date. It has been warm. It's February. It's a leap year. It has been unseasonably warm uh, here in Philly, and there's actually a term for it. It's called Fool Spring because it's going to get cold again, probably. Huh? I should have lost that. You did. Um, if you're from the Mid Atlantic area, you'll know that, you know, we'll get spring, we'll flirt with spring weather. Oh, this, wow, this egg is actually taking a while, too. We'll flirt with spring weather. And then the next thing you know, we'll get snow, you know, the following week. So, is that going to happen here? I don't know. Yeah, I knew there was a trainer down here. Oh, you probably got Birdcatcher. 
What kind of balls do you use? Yeah, you can also say hello. Good evening. Good to see you. What kind of balls do you use? Uh, I am get I am getting tired. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. It is like quarter after eleven, and it, it amazes me. I, I'm not saying I'm the smartest person ever, because believe me, I'm not. But it amazes me when someone asks me what time it is, and I say, "Oh, it's quarter past eleven. It's quarter of noon," and they actually get like annoyed because they have to think about what the heck that means and it's crazy nowadays i i know i might have younger viewers at some point but there are a lot of kids i've come to realize that can't read an analog clock they can't read a clock that has hands on it everything we have now is digitized phone the uh, clock here on my computer i do have my apple watch set to ah uh, i keep uh, i keep saying brand names by accident i have my highly sophisticated watch set to an analog mode. I don't know, to kind of like keep my brain sharp in that sense uh, when I check the time. Let's see, we can always find topics to talk about. Even if it's just me and you. Me and me. Me, me and my thoughts. Yikes, not fast enough. Okay, well, you better be worth it, item that I came all the way out here for. Roll out. Oh, that's right. Roll out. In fact, wasn't... That's funny, because wasn't this TM actually at one point defense curl? Like, and it's... Ooh, I just realized that. Wait a second. Can can um Quilliam learn roll out? Because if Quilliam can... Quilliam can. I remember, thanks to J-Rose, to J-Rose, that... Oopsies. That rollout, the first turn of rollout, if you use defense curl prior to it, the first roll of rollout is essentially the second one. So you get that times two damage early, then it goes three, four, five, six. So you basically get, you skip that first stage of rollout, and then you get a bonus rollout that's even higher. Um, I'm just trying to think where that would come into play and who that would benefit. Like, it's not going to benefit us right now, and do I even want to keep Defense Curl on Quilliam? I don't know. Um, but anyway, we saved. Okay, so let's go give a shot at the gym. Um, I'm, just trying, I'm just trying to think of who... I mean... Who has the XP share right now? Is it Hoppled? Oh, Hoppled. We yeah, we can we can switch out that um, XP share. You're you're good. Um, I guess let's give it to Albert because I mean we're still gonna run Quilliam in there a bit, and there's I'm not saying there's no point of leveling up Quilliam, but I just know and I think. No, I don't need another one. I think I remember Smith saying something about giving... I want to say I remember him talking about giving Miltank Earthquake. Yo, champ in the making. This gym is home to a normal-type Pokemon leader. Be cautious of her cute team. Aww. Her teddy bear might look nice, but I've seen it shatter rocks. Head to Route 34 if you need a fighting type. That's interesting that he said that. In fact... Um... Interesting, or a couple of so one Teddy Ursa would have to be in there. So Route 34 is the route just to the south, and I guess that's where Mankey was. But we got Machop already. Um, but I I did mention earlier the idea of having a female Pokemon if Attract is still a thing. Oh, you are a cute little trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. Hey yo, let's take it slow. Take the steps, man, not the elevator. Beauty Victoria wants to battle. There's Teddy Ursa. That is, again, Picasso's favorite. But can I do a... Can I impersonate Picasso? Uh, 
Okay, I do this. Uh, Invitation is the highest form of flattery. Teddy Ursa? Hello, friend. That was all. That was horrible. That was horrible. I'm sorry. I could probably do a J Rose better because of um, his speaking voice when he narrates. And J Rose is awesome. J Rose is awesome. Um, like, even though I've never spoken to him or anything like that, like I feel like even if I haven't watched his videos for a long time, like I'm like talking to a friend. Hey everyone, how's it going? Nah, that wasn't that good either. J Rose does some crazy stuff. Um, again, I, 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 am I giving these guys free publicity? Because if anything, like it just it it, it 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 is, but it isn't. Like who's if you if you're watching me, there's no way you haven't watched these other guys. Let's oh wait, hold on. Let's see. Oops, it's over. Yeah, yeah, girl, it is. Um, just thinking. I, I mean, I'm just gonna keep. Porky up front, because if he's going to be our ace, I mean, I can't remember when he evolves him a choke. It's got to be in the 20s, right? Did you know that this gym, if you zoom out, it's the shape of a Clefairy? Give it your best shot, or I'll take you down. Whoa! Whoa! I have... A significant other girlfriend and I love her very much I'm gonna need you ladies to stop coming on to me I can't believe I had to I ever had to say that sentence ladies please stop coming on to me yo that egg hasn't hatched yet I don't know why the Togepi egg took like two seconds I'm so sorry. Meowth does not accept your apology. What's the reason that Meowth can talk in the anime and none of the others can? And it not only talked, but it had like a, a wise guy voice like this. Right? I haven't watched the anime in so long. Prepare to blast off or or die. Don't let my Pokemon's key looks fool you. They can whip Whoa! There's some freaks in this gym. Jeez. Watch. Last carry wants to battle. A little more than just that. So is like Snubble wearing a dress? Was that always its thing? Porky is trying to learn Seismic Toss. That's how the N64 statement announcer pronounced it. I think it's Seismic. Do we want to teach se Seismic Toss? I feel like it's not really... Uh, I mean, actually, it could be helpful. Uh, let's just get rid of Leer, I guess. Albert gained 118. Don, I thought you were weak. Nah, I'm, I'm strong sauce. All right, this is the last uh, regular trainer in the gym. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon, but I have strong and cute Pokemon. <laughs> Aren't you quirky? Last Bridget wants to fight you. Oh, Napalm, the tail slapping Pokemon. It'll slap you in the face. I guess, I guess most Pokemon can do that, right? Albert grew to 19. Hey, I remember you. 
We got rid of you. Boom. Oh no, no, no! Oh yes, yes, yes. We're about to go heal up, I'm gonna pause, and then we will take on Whitney. And once again, I pause the recording, and in the middle of doing the healing, we get the hum message. So let's see what you are. Um, oh, you know what I should have done? I didn't even think about that. We should have bet whether or not it would have been a shiny. But um, let's just see. Mm -hmm. Tyrogue, huh? Okay. I forgot he was one of the options. Hmm. Give it in a tie, Rogue. I mean, I don't know if we're going to keep him or not. I'm going to go run and uh, deposit. He's not even a shiny. I'm going to run and deposit him. Okay, we're back from that. I put tie, Rogue in the PC, and I actually took Paris out um, because, I, well, I don't... We can't use items in battle, but I figured why not just put a sacrificial Pokemon in there if we had to do some sort of switch or had to burn a turn or something like that. Um, at least it's there for that. We can't do that uh, without a Pokemon there. And I just don't I don't want to get attached to Tyrogue, as weird as that says. But anywho, um, so we are about to face off against Whitney. This will be our... This will be the only attempt. Um, let's actually put on... Hardstone for for Rocky. Yeah, we'll take the bitter berry back. We will t give the Miracle Seed to Hoppled. And I mean, is there really anything we can give? Oh, I just realized we could totally get the charcoal from Azalea. All right. Well, I mean. Uh, and I guess, um, I'll get, uh, I'll give a, I don't know if there's anything that's going to paralyze me, but I'll just give it to Porky and we'll give a bitter berry to Quilliam. Uh, I, I'm not going all the way back to, uh, Azalea for the charcoal. It's getting late and, uh, a lot of you want to cash in your bets. So I, I, I don't know. The team, I don't know the levels. We're just going to give it a shot. Whatever happens, happens, all right? Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was in the Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want to bet? I'm warning you, I'm good. Let's see. The woman who's caused many young children nightmares. Leader Whitney leading off with Clefairy. Okay, and it's just straight nor oh level twenty. We're not we don't even have a level twenty mon, do we? Oh we're yeah, we're we're toast. Oh no, Hopple of all people people. Pokemon Hoppled is the one that's level twenty one. Um I feel like I should have led off with a different Pokemon. Yeah, it's got charm. Yeah, charm can be a problem. So yeah, that's that's another reason for like situations like that. Oh, okay, nice Porky. For situations like that with a stat reduction. So I mean, hopefully it doesn't resort to us having to use Paris as a as a as a uh, blah, 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 roulette. But we'll see. Carousel. I think that's what I meant was carousel, right? Did I say roulette in the other video? A carousel. Yeah, carousel. Roulette is a. We're talking about gambling all the time. That's why why you are betting is here. Okay, now you want to go to milk tank. Uh, oh, no, no, no. I didn't want that. I didn't want that. Okay. It could help us out. Let's see. But we're going to have to switch into Rocky or Paris at some point for these. Now, low kick does help with the heavier Pokemon. It's super effective. But I think after this one, we're going to have to switch out. Yeah, we're going to switch out after this one. Oh! Okay! Okay! That... I I have never had that simple of a time beating the mill tank, but yet again, I also am 32, and this is a game for children. 
All right, friend. Are you the ace? No, you're not the ace. Are we actually going to beat... Oh, that was a good headbutt. Wow. How do you like them apples? How do you like them eggs? How do you like them grapes? How do you like them chicken wings? We knocked out and beat Whitney on the first try. There is a huge smile on my face right now. We got the under. Why are you betting cleared under half an attempt? Plus money. Three videos. Three gym leader battles. Three wins. Sob. 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 Uh, sob. I want you to sob, girl. Sob. Why? You're mean. That's right. Uh huh, sob. You shouldn't be so serious. Uh, wait, are you delirious? Uh, why you bumping out that milk tank? Uh, don't you know that milk tank milk stank? Uh huh. You child? Are you are you serious? I mean, a child? Wah! Hold on. Wah! Lose? Wait, day? I told you stop crying after you lose. Wah! <laughs> Snivel hick, you meanie. Whitney? Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries and she loses. And see, back to that whole like gym leader evaluation thing, like that's not normal. And you could actually very well leave this gym and be stuck without your badge. What? Why you want a badge? Oh, right. I forgot who's playing bad. Playing <laughs> bad since your Pokemon used to the fight battle. And I'm supposed to Pokemon speed. So you guys <laughs> too. It's only fitting as we have Rocky. I can't use Dig here. All right. Wow. Okay. This is our longest video yet, but it was well worth the time spent and all that good stuff. Right? Right? Because we now have our third batch. The plain badge. Look how plain that is. That nice yellow badge. That they put no effort into that, but you know what? We still bought the games and... Still ate it all up. I had a great time, everyone. I hope you had a great time, too. Um, that is it for tonight. I am going to go to bed. Uh, I don't know when the next uh, playthrough will be. I tried to get the highlights up before I do the next long through. Long playthrough, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to bed. Good night.